Dominique Morisot's hard-hitting drama Pipeline takes a deep look into the American educational system for underprivileged students. Naya is an inner-city high school teacher whose son Omari is educated at a private boarding school. She is desperate to give him opportunities that her students will never see, and she is determined to fight for his future. When he gets into an altercation with a teacher, Naya and Omari are forced to deal with the reality of the pitfalls of a divided education system, the social prophecy that surrounds them, Omari's sense of righteous rage, and the uncomfortable tensions within their family dynamic. This is the Level 4 student's personalized interpretation of what Omari really wants to say to his mother. We believe it is important that students are not only represented, but from their point of view. Listen! I have all this stuff to say, but I don't know how to say it. I want to explain, but it's hard. I want you to listen to me and what I have to say. Because what's important is to tell you the truth. Lying won't help. To hear me, listen to me, to understand what I'm trying to say. I need you to support me. When I'm excited, be happy for me. I want you to trust me, eh? I will tell you everything. Calm down. down. The more you talk to me like that, the more I'm not going to want to talk to you. Try to be the person I can talk to. Try not to argue. Talk to me. Don't snap on me. Listen to me and don't interrupt. Try to be a person I can talk to, not someone I have to tolerate. I want you to know how I feel. I appreciate you looking out for me and buying me things and making sure I'm straight and good. But I want you to sit down and talk to me. Be a mother to me. I didn't mean to do it, but the teacher got to me. I was pretty mad about that. I wasn't having a good day, so I knew I had to leave. I need to leave when I need to. I admit I was wrong for getting aggressive. He made me feel discriminated against even when I told him to leave me alone. This isn't the first time he targets me. Talk to him. Furthermore, you should never put me in that prep school because I felt out of place. Put me back into my area. I'm out of my element. Out of my comfort zone. Of course, if you put me back, nothing might change at all. I wish you could. I, I wish you could. I wish you could understand me more. I, I wish you could tolerate who I date and who I hang around. I wish you could stay home and make dinners as a mom. I wish you wouldn't drink and smoke all the time. I wish you wouldn't call me names just to make me feel bad. I wish you could be happy because I'm happy. You can't invalidate my emotions. Out of all people should know the struggles we go through as black people. Don't always blame me when people dislike me. You don't know my situation. Don't threaten to send me by my dad. Stop disliking some of my friends. Make some time to help me with school. Trust me to go to parties when you know I'm responsible enough. Cut me some slack when my room is a mess and my mental health sucks. Trust me to make the right decisions. I apologize for the stretch I have cut. Seeing you like this really impacts me. I get what are you doing, what are you doing, but maybe. Talk to someone. Talk to me. I'm your son. I'm, I'm a listener. listener. 